Japan. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. Welcome to the EBM Scholars Show. And today I'm here. As you can see in front of me, I have uh, a screen showing you uh, the status if you have won the green card lottery. Uh, because people do not know what happens if you check your uh, green card lottery results. Uh, your entry will say your entry has either been selected or not selected. So if your, ent your entry has not been selected, that means your lottery application, in case you have checked your green card lottery results, let's say for the year 2021, for the DV 2021, which the results are out, we are going to be out on May, it will say your entry has not been selected. That means you didn't win green card lottery. But if you have won the green card lottery, it will say your entry has been selected. And then it will give you uh, usually, all the time I say about confirmation number, I mean the, uh, the, the case number, there is a confirmation number and the case number. This is the case na confirmation number, is the number used to apply. Then if you win, they give you the case number, the number which all the time it will determine you when you can go to the interview. But also what is the most important about that one, it is the letter which is the, called the first notification letter or the first letter from the KCC Kentucky Consular Center, that means to notify you that you have won the green card lottery. So this is a very quick short video to tell you what is that sample letter look like. So this is the actual letter of someone, my nephew who won the green card lottery and is now here. So it will have the information from the US government. So this is in case you have checked the results and it says, uh, remove the word not, it will say your entry has been selected. Then it will have a press you click to see the PDF letter, the first notification of letter. The second notification letter from Kentucky or from KCC, it will be the letter to be in, informing you the day for the interview, obviously after filling the DSC 260. So the letter will come from Kentucky, William, Williamsburg, Kentucky. Uh, Kentucky is a state in, here in the United States. So this person won the year, tw the results of May 20. 17. So for the person to come between October 2017 to end of September 2018. And when to come will be determined by the case number. And I mean, I will explain to you and I'll give the sample number of this person and what does that mean for that way. So it will have the year, uh, it will have the year of uh, when the results were coming out, the year of the results. So it's not the year of when you apply, it will be the year of the results because the results came out uh, on May 2nd during this year. So for that case, so this year, it will say May 50, 2020. Last year, it was May 7th, 2019. Uh, so that was the, so uh, this year it will be May, all the letters, whether you check your results in June, whatever. So the date here is the date of the results when it came out the first day of the results. So the results for this year, it will be May 50, 2020. It will have your name, the name of the winner here, or like in this case is Christopher. Then it will have the address. So the address here, it will appear as you put the address basing on your application for the DV lottery. Then it will have the country where you are, f you are from. Then, it will have your name, dear so and so. Your name is the winner. It the, how they write the name is your first name, middle name, last name. If you don't have the middle name, it will have your first name and last name. If you have four names, it will have your four names because some people they have four names. Then it will inform you you have been randomly selected for further processing in the diversity visa program for the FISO year. So for this year, it will be 2021. Here it is 2018 because I'm talking previously. So to say for the year 2021. And that means it, it will give you the year of processing. This is the year of processing that the last person, the first day of the person to come, which we say from October 1st, 2020 to September 30th, 2021. Because that is the last time someone has to appear on the visa interview. This is the best, very important, uh, uh, let me uh, a little bit zoom. This is a very important uh, information. The selection does not guarantee that you will receive a visa. 
So you have won. So don't start making a celebration and informing the entire village that you have won the Green Candy Lottery. You haven't won. I mean, you yes, you have won the lottery, but you haven't been given the visa. Is not a guarantee. Why? Because the number of applicants selected is greater than the number of visas available. They take more than 75,000 people. So there are some people, their case number, it will be 65,000. But in the end, majority of people will be given will be 50,000 people. Majority of people who will be coming to US are not exceeding 55,000. The maximum year they came in the last 15 years was 52,000 people. But in most cases, it's 47,000 up to 50,000. That is the majority of the time. And again, apart from that, something also to consider, apart from being the number being higher than that one, in other time, you cannot be given the visa because you said you have medical, you have met qualification, but actual you don't have the qualifications. And now they have added some other things like, uh, let's say the to be a public charge or few other things, and you cannot get through the visa interview. So there are all other things that will make you not get the visa. So don't mean don't start making celebration and starting eating chicken and rice or something whatever big celebration. Selection does not, uh, it's not a guarantee that you are going to receive the visa. Therefore, it is important uh, that, therefore, uh, it's very important that you carefully follow instruction to increase your chances of possible visa insurance. The instruction, they'll be there, but also you have to fill the DS-260. I'll have the video talking about that, but I want just to show you just this one. So, Print out this letter and take it with you, you with this letter to the interview. So if you win, it doesn't mean that you are going to have an interview right away. You will fill the DSC 260, and then based on your case number, down the road you will be called for the visa interview. But you will be told to submit certain information to KCC. All the let email you will be receiving, they will be coming from this email address. Uh, KCCDV, that means Kentucky uh, Consular Center, diversity visa at state.gov, must have .gov. Or if you want to write an email to them, you have to write on this one. Uh, this email, when you write, make sure that you have to put your case number and the year of birth. That is supposed to include on every, every communication you are writing to them. And if you have never, if you haven't won the green card lottery, don't write to them because you don't have case number. Their job is not to respond to people who haven't won. It's for people who have won the green card lottery. They are the ones supposed to do that. And this is their uh, cell phone. I mean, their phone number. If you call, you have to call basing on the Eastern Standard Time, the Eastern Time of United States. So don't wake up. Uh, don't just at, uh, during the day, like at uh, seven or whatever you know it is in the afternoon in your country to just call direct us it is night so that doesn't work for you make sure that you, you confirm the time for that situation then this is the example of the case number the case number so here it is starting with the year of the lottery the year you are supposed to come to us so for this year it will be 2021 so this will be the case number different from the confirmation number confirmation number is the one you are using to check the results which in this case is this one, the one with the letters and whatever, all this long one. But after winning, they'll give you a case number. So it will be 2021. Then it will be AF for Africa, AS for Asia, whatever, Latin America will be L, whatever. So it will be the region. AF Africa. Then it will have the number. On this one, these numbers, uh, so basically forget about the zeros. So it is 47,000 and whatever this person's number is that number. So if the, your number will be, for instance, like, because this person is 47,000, the case number usually I tell people it determines when you will be called for the interview. So the interview of this person, if it will be for the DV 2021, you get the results uh, this uh, in May, this person will have the interview maybe in June, July, or even August, but most will be in July 2021. But if you, they, let's say the person's number was maybe uh, 400 and something, obvious the person number is 405 or 1,000 number, 4,000 number, up to 5,000 maybe, the interview will be in October. If your case number is within 10,000, by December we have the interview. 
So this is how it is on how we can be able to see that way. And in order to uh, to make it easier for you, let me show you something else. Uh, there is what we call visa bulletin. Uh, so this visa bulletin, visa bulletin is when you can be able to uh, to see. Uh, it shows you. So for instance, I'm talking about the visa bulletin. Let's say for March. We are in the month of March. So this one it gives you to know when is your visa available. Like, like when. Uh, so this one it shows you. Uh, for for this year, I'm giving example. It shows you so who are supposed to go for the green card lottery visa interview. So if you are going for the visa sponsored uh, family sponsored, so forget about everything. You scroll down about apart from green card uh, based on the employment, all other things. Forget about all those things. You scroll down until you come to the diversity visa category. So for the month of March, which people will be uh, having interview? So they say, so for Africa, this will be the number. So now in month of March, the peop, up to people on this case number, 31,500 will be into the green card lottery uh, visa called for the interview. For the people, except this will be exception for the people in Egypt. In Egypt, well, there will be up to 22,000, whatever. For the Asia, this will be, they'll be interviewing to this number, except for this country. Europe, that one, North America, and especially Bahamas, uh, Oceania, then uh, South America and the Caribbean, that is the, the number they will be interviewing. So that is uh, something uh, you can be able to, to see when we say uh, that is the uh, uh, case number of someone. So that is what I mean, like, what does that mean in the visa bulletin quick way, how to be able to do that? So if you go, let's say, like, I want to see the April, usually they give you at least a two months in advance, I think. So let me keep zooming. So you can scroll down until we go to the, uh, the diversity visa section. So this is the diversity visa section. You, you saw at the, the previous one on March, they were in 31,000 something. So the month of April, was uh it will be up to 41,000 so then may june around that time so for the someone who is 40 something will be around that time so that is how you can be able to see the uh the sample of the that is the i was showing you the sample of uh if you was you have not been selected but in case you have been selected, what happens if you have been selected? So that is the letter of, in case you have been selected, that is the sample letter of the green card lottery notification. First notification is a winner, how it looks like. So the most important things when you get it is here, when you can see the case number. So if your case number, it will be very, very good to start the process quicker uh, to do the applying, I mean, filling the DSC 260, things of that nature. I will have the separate video explaining the case number, I um, mean, the how to fill the DS-260 tutorial and the things of that nature. In case of any question, please put the question on the, uh, on my comment uh, section here. I'll be happy to answer that kind of question. Otherwise, all the best to check your results. And I believe your results will not say your end has not been selected. It will say your end has been selected. So. On May 1st, uh, May 5th, when it comes in the result, please check your result and let me know that if you have won. And in case you need any advice from me uh, on the next process on how to find the uh, host in the US, how to fill the DS260, how to fill the public charge form, things of that nature, I'll be happy to guide you into that route. All the best, everyone. Remember to subscribe and share the video to others.